have a very important announcement because it is a very special morning for the Today Show family because today Carl turns 10. That's right, it is Carl's 10th anniversary. <laughs> yes. Now, he had Ten. absolutely no idea that we were aware that this anniversary was happening. In fact, you probably didn't even realise it was your 10th anniversary. I feel like five. Yeah. Well, unfortunately, I've only spent eight of those years with you. Mm. But um, you are my TV husband. Mm. You know how much I love you. Um, so I'm glad that everybody's already applauded. But 10 years is a very special anniversary to mark. And I've been doing my sums, Carl. Because I don't have much of a life, as you know. <laughs> and I reckon that you have now done over 8,000 hours of breakfast television and that officially makes you the most watched person, person on Australian TV ever. What? Wow. And wow. here's a whole decade's worth of reasons why. Mm. Wow. Everything okay? Thank you for coming in. Are you doing that with love? Sexy. Not looking. Not you, darling. He's just being tough. Is this footage going to come back to haunt us or what? Working with Carl, as I have for the last eight years now, has been a complete joy. Look. <laughs> Jen has just spent the last segment spray tanning Carl Stefanovic. Can I say that I gave him a few extra coats just because I love him? <laughs> I said you're having a good time. It's hot. <laughs> Harper, they didn't disappear. He was skinned alive. <laughs> Uh, Very good. You like it? Very good. I love uh, you, man. The wonderful thing about Carl is every single day is different. The Dalai Lama walks into a pizza shop. Pizza shop, yeah. Yeah, pizza. And says, Can you make me one with everything? What's that? You know what I mean? <laughs> Can you make me one oh. with everything? <laughs> oh. Oh, I knew that wouldn't work. You never quite knew what to expect. You never quite knew which direction we were going to. It's gold logie planking, that is. I'll get a cram. <laughs> Tastes like chicken. Come here. That's why blokes don't cook. Come because here. we just get criticised. <laughs> he is a good cook. Is shocking with animals. So wake me up when it's all over. When I'm wiser and I'm older. What is going on? <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's good at that. Today, with Tracy Grimshaw and Carl Stefanovic. And good morning, everyone. Welcome to a new today, our new home, our new family. Carl? It's lovely to be here. It's good to have you. I look forward to being here for another 10 years. I think he's still very much the same person, just a lot more polished. When I make a joke, I want everyone to laugh, no matter how lame it is. All right? OK, I'm not doing that. <laughs> the thing about Carl that's never changed is that he's an original unit. Um, and he was an original unit from day one. From that Valentine's debut, Ten years ago to where we are now, it's a very different Carl. Certainly on the outside, he's still the scallywag that he always was on the inside. Hello and welcome to you and a special edition of the Logies. It is 5.30, it is bright and it is very early. <laughs> the Logies will always have a special place in my heart when it comes to Carl. I can't believe how good you look this morning. Oh, sure. Australia realised that, you know, he's as, about as real an Aussie bloke as you could possibly find. And I think it was at that point Australia kind of went, you know what? I really like this guy, and if I was going to the Logies, I'd have a good time like he did. Working with Carl is an absolute joy. People are always fascinated by Carl. They say, what, what's Carl really like? I always say, Carl is an intoxicating mix of world's best broadcaster and naughty schoolboy. 
and long may that continue. In the city centre, the terror was amplified. Look at the stars, look how they shine for you. Jokes aside, when there's a breaking news story, there's no one better in TV than Carl. He's quite brilliant at it. A defining moment in history. Barack Obama lives Martin Luther King's dream, becoming America's first black president. There's a certain exhilaration to campaigning. No one is buying Carl, what you I are selling, is the there. point. No one is buying what you are selling. You know, Rupert Murdoch's wife, Wendy Dung, is a Chinese spy. Clive, she, have she you was lost trained the plot? In... This morning, the Today Show is live in Beaconsfield. There it is. It's true. They're back. When that wall of water came through here three days ago, it was well and truly above my head. So we will continue to filter any information that comes to hand this morning right through to you directly as soon as we possibly can. Carl Stephanopoulos. I don't think I would have predicted the gold Logie, but I definitely predicted a big future for him. Grumpy Cat, good morning. Are you happy to be do doing this interview with the Today Show in Australia? <laughs> Look at that cat. <laughs> Look at that cat. Look at this little baby's face. There's a little baby right there. The bass and the tweeters make the speakers go to war. He talks a big game, but he can back it up. He's a genuinely good bloke and a good guy to work with. He's got a bit of a natural flair for sport. Yeah, he does. Took on Wendell, didn't he? Yeah, 110. Ball the muscle, big Delph, and they went and had that fight, which was entertaining. I thought it was very good. He actually held his own uh, against the big Dell, which wouldn't be easy. Oh, oh my and uh, the other thing was AFL. What can't he do, the big unit? Carl has been wearing exactly the same suit every single day on this show, at this desk, in that chair, uh, for one whole year. I think in this situation, for women on TV, it's mainly women judging women and what they wear. And you've been changing, your, presumably, your undies and your socks. So that's that's possibly why people didn't... You don't wear undies, OK? It's hard not to have fun when you're working with Carl because he's always looking for the laugh. Occasionally, the prank blew up in his face. Do I feel guilty about the hot chilli pie prank? No. No. It was gold. It was good TV. And that's all he really cares about. Once he knows that his job is done, he's made some good TV, he's happy. Galileo! Galileo! Galileo Magnifico! He can't sing. Ooh la la, ooh la la, ooh. I set out to get you with a fine tooth comb. Call him what you will. He is a clown sometimes. He is an awful dancer. He is an even worse singer. Because we got nothing. Cause we got nothing to be guilty of I shot the sheriff I've been really trying Raymond Were they laggies last night? <laughs> Don't you say a word against Carl's dancing I'm too hot Call the police and the firemen I'm too hot Make a dragon wanna retire Man, I'm too hot Crumpet! Look at that! Hug? No. <laughs> oh. Believe it or not, I'm walking on air. I never thought I could feel so free. Giving you a man <laughs> hug down the line, mate. <laughs> Thank you. <Huh? laughs> Thank you. We love sitting next to each other every morning. I can't imagine doing this with anybody else. I'm the man. I don't like the attention. <laughs> Please, more, some more. <laughs> no, thank you to
you everyone for um, for making the 10 years fly by. I mean, we started with um, with Tracy that 10 years ago. I mean, it, it feels like yesterday. Um, and to all the wonderful people behind the scenes um, who um, have shared the experience of 10 years with me, um, you all know who you are. You're all here, and uh, well, most of you are here. Um, some of you have gone to opposition networks on more money, but <laughs> the, majority, the majority are here. And uh, to everyone here, um, especially the team that, that is here um, right now, um, who have been there um, in. It really means uh, so much to be working with people who you both admire professionally, but more importantly, you, you love as friends. And uh, and you are all um, that, um, especially you, young lady. And I think um, love you, know, you to bits. Yeah. Mm. Oh. Congratulations. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Congratulations. We're You've got to so... take advantage, please. <laughs> you make coming to work so much fun every single day, and just on a professional level. Um, I. I as I said in that package, I can't imagine working with anybody else. Mm. You are a great friend and a fabulous professional. So thank you for... I've only had the eight years, but um, you're, a, you're an absolute treat. And awesome to get on the drink with, right? Oh, fabulous. Yeah. Right, eh? The best. <laughs> just awesome. We all know that. <laughs> really? <laughs> thank you, guys. Um, and look, I look forward to the next ten. Um, it's just... Uh, it's, it's... Do I? Another ten? <laughs> Another ten? Really? Just get no, to know about that. I really don't. I really don't mean what I say. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, everyone, and uh, look, uh, thank you, and most importantly for everyone at home, uh, for for watching us. You know, yeah, and, it's, and for being um, for being understanding of my weird personality quirks, uh, which are many. Um, you never really know. These guys don't know who's going to show up in the morning, but you at home don't don't know either. <laughs> um, so thank you for for watching over I, the years. I did say when you so. started, it would take probably two years for people yeah. at home to understand you. Uh, that's blown out to about ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's still a few people out there that don't quite get you, but. We just want to say, uh, from us, the people who do get you, you're a great bloke, you're a lovely man, you're a good friend, and you're a horrible dancer. <laughs> Keep Thank it going, you, my friend. I love it. And just when you thought all of the announcements were over, we have one more big announcement a little bit later in the show. I'm pregnant. Hold on. <laughs> 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 You hide it well. Oh. <laughs>